Welcome back guys, I've got something a bit different to show you today. I wanted to showcase the first version of a training mod that I've been working on. The community have been asking for more options in the training arena since the game first launched. In December 2016, Sonics released this in-game custom training browser which gave players a ton of new options. The browser is a great training solution for both PC and console and with four tabs there are recreations of both offensive and defensive scenarios, packs designed to train a specific skill and even packs to replicate high level plays seen in pro games. You can create and publish your own packs or play one published by somebody else. If you look around there are also a ton of packs created specifically by pro players themselves, so definitely go check those out if you're wanting to train a specific skill. Buckus mod was the first step in giving the community more variation in training, and currently offers a ton of additional options in the training arena. My favourite, and probably the most used one, is the addition of keybinds and actions in free play. With the press of a button you can send the ball hurling towards the backboard so that you can practice your reads, pop it up in front of you to practice air dribbling, receive a mid-air pass, skip custom training rounds and so much more. Buckus has packed a ton of new features into the game, with shot variation, mirrored levels, pretty much if it's been requested it's an option inside a Buckus mod. If you haven't already and you're on PC go check it out, the link will be in the description. So what else could be added to training? I browsed through reddit looking for some inspiration and came across some incredible ideas. One that shone above the rest, which happened to be the top of all time when searching for custom training, was a post by reddit user Dark Penguins. They'd created a compilation of quite a few mod ideas. Scrolling through them it really confirmed to me how many features were packed into Bacchus mod. It already has user defined goal blockers, the ability to turn off unlimited boost, a speed indicator and a shot skipper and randomizer. So to create something that hadn't been done before, I had to choose one of the other options. One that stood out to me was the ability to place objects on the field. I've created some really fun workshop maps and was confident that I could apply that knowledge and achieve a world builder of sorts inside the game itself. Here is the first look at my take on an extended Rocket League training mode. And this is an alpha version, not released to the public yet, but once the bugs and tweaks have all been worked out, there'll be a full release with all features seen here. Let's sing a song full of hope, full of pain. Why don't you sing along, my friend, for it's our last refrain. Forever young, ever strong, ever brave. Memories like this never end, no, they don't fade away. So when I'm gone, oh, when I'm gone, I'll be right there, close to the sun. Keep holding on. Thanks for watching guys and if you want to stay up to date with all of my mods make sure you subscribe. 